So one of the cool new features of Lightroom 3 is the different published service options we have here in the published services panel. That's kind of a tongue twister. Anyway, the published services allows us to basically take photos directly from Lightroom straight to our hard drive to a preset location and setup, just how we would like with an export preset, or we can take it directly to Facebook, to our Facebook accounts post on our wall in albums, or to Flickr, or to even SmugMug if you guys have SmugMug accounts. So I'm going to show you guys how to set these up, and let's get started by first doing the hard drive published services setup. So let's click on setup right here. And again, you can select which one you want to set up right from in here or right from the published service menu right there too. So what we're going to do is we're going to say this is the SLR Lounge Test Publishing. Or we'll say Publishing Test. That makes a little more sense, right? Okay, and we're going to choose a location. Let's set up our location to that same folder that we did last time. Actually, no, let's put it on our desktop. So every time we publish something, it goes right into our desktop. And we'll put it under a folder called Temporary Publications. That makes it sound really important. All right, so under File Naming, again, I'm going to do my renaming in, in Lightroom itself. I don't need it to rename on when it's exporting. Um, for file settings, this is going to work exactly the same way as our... Uh, as our exporting works. So what I can do is I'll just, we'll leave it for, let's say this is going to be for web. So I'm going to believe this is 80% um, sRGB, that's fine, JPEG. I'm going to resize it because I want it to be for web again. Long edge, 700 pixels. Resolution, I want it to be screen sized. Um, we're going to sharpen it for the screen and have high. We'll minimize the embedded data because this is going all over the web. And then we'll use our one size fits all. I really should have created a better looking stamp, but I'll leave that up to you guys. You guys can create your good looking stamps. So, um, and then we're going to hit save. Okay, now it creates a new uh, publish option right here with the name that we just specified. Now to publish to it, all I got to do is drag whatever images I want to publish. So let's say I select these three images, drag them right into temporary publications, click that option so I can see my images in temporary publications and all I do is go to the top right and hit publish. Okay, so now it moves these. It says new photos to publish. It moves them from new photos to publish photos. So we can see what we've actually taken to the hard drive. It's still finishing up that last one. There we go. Okay, so if I go to my hard drive, I can see all these locations. Let's check it out. Temporary publications, and there are my three files. So the cool thing about these uh, publishing services is that it retains the information as to what's been published and what hasn't. So it shows you in here what's been published, and, and basically it's just a, another way of keeping track of what you've actually taken outside of, of Lightroom. Uh, so let's go on to the next tutorial. We're going to show you guys how to set up Facebook as well as the Flickr account for published services.